Hello everyone and welcome back to the final mansion of Luigi's Mansion 2 HD. I'm Derez Plays. Last time we finished the secret level of the secret mine, which when I originally played the game on my 3DS and it's all personal playthrough, so it's my personal experience, I despised the secret mine. Playing on it, playing the secret mine on the HD remake, it's now increased. It's no longer my least favorite. I would say it's probably above Gloomy Manor, below Haunted Towers. So it's now my fourth favorite. But now we're going to my second favorite, Treacherous Mansion. This is like a museum of sorts. This massive mansion is filled with exotic exhibits created by its late globe trotting owner. Oh, and it also contains the strongest paranormal signals ever recorded. We're going to get started with E-1, the front door key. The paranormal activities in this mansion is completely off the charts. Stay on your toes and start looking for the dark moon piece. Luigi, the final dark moon piece appears to be located here in the treacherous mansion. But I'm reading the highest levels of paranormal activity ever recorded in the history of forever. No paranormal researcher worth their salt would go near the place. Yep, going in there is an absolutely terrible idea. For me, you on the other hand. Well, you don't have a choice. You're the only one who can recover the final dark moon piece. But don't despair, son. Look on the bright side. You, um, you, uh, you have a very bushy mustache. Why, thank you all. Uh, sorry, I'm no good at pep talks. Anywho, take this here front door key to the treacherous mansion. Why, thank you. It'll make getting into the mansion a whole lot easier, so don't go losing it. I tried to pinpoint the dark moon piece, but there's just too much paranormal interference in there. You'll have to look for it the old-fashioned way. Good luck, Luigi. You're gonna need it. And off we go to the final mansion. This is my second favorite under the old clockwork because I still enjoy the old clockwork a little bit more. The clock desert theme was really good and Treacherous Mansion has this museum aesthetic to it. It doesn't really have a unique theme compared to our other mansions because it's a conglom cog Glominate, I don't even know how to pronounce it. It's a combination of all the other mansions in one. Like you can even see the forest area from here. Oop, and we almost lost our hat. Now why Egad didn't just warp us closer is beyond me. Let's get going. Just be extra careful. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Uh, excuse? Oh, now it's using just my control stick. That's right, I turned off gyro. Here I am trying to tilt my controller to rebalance Luigi. I don't have to worry about that. Okay. Now, fortunately, just up ahead. Oh, and this is how we lose Luigi forever. Okay. Well, the camera is working, so again, no idea why Egad didn't spawn us right at the door. But let's get the uh, key in the door. Ooh. 
Hold to pop. No doggy. No, that's my key. Bad doggy. <laughs> I totally forgot y'all says that that. Bad doggy. Okay, well, now we have the two passages opened on the left and right. Let's see what's beyond here. <gasps> Purple toad. Oh. Ooh, there's another toad. Oh. And into the picture. Okay, well, that... Is not surprising to be honest. Uh, but we did see who was in charge of what was going on with those toads. Oh, they're playing tennis. Uh oh. Hi there. Yes, flee. And then. Oh! I actually was not certain if that was where. Okay. What else do we have? Well, I see the polterpot. And off he flees. like I do okay I do go down the well oh there's polter pop look at him being a cutie with that little helmet okay so we d oh Hello. yeah bad dog that polter pop is just sitting there Barely out of reach. If only he knew the trouble he's causing us. Do you happen to have a haunted doggy treat on you? Maybe you can lure him over. Sorry, I just realized how ridiculous that sounded. I guess you're going to need to find some other way in there, son. Yes, we know exactly which way. Okay. That crow is stuck in the wall. <laughs> huh. Okay. Down we go. Bottom of well. I see that was just a fake wall. Suck up the fungi. And pull. I think I have a uh, wall to destroy oh and oh there goes the pull to pop the guard tunnel pull oh suck up the two greenies Just the one smasher? It 
was until the greenie got involved. Uh, but that did show me that there's something. Oh no, that greenie was just stupid. Okay. So that's the end of the hall. So now let's go this way. What is this way? The cliff side. Run, 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 run. Okay, so that's if I need to backtrack. Ceremonial chambers. Oops. Boop. Okay. Well, that just went down. Pull. Okay. Let's get some of these lit. Oh! Scary night. Hello? Oh, that one's moving. Pull! This one up. Okay. What's back here? More monies. Uh, you just rattle. That gives me a doggy bone. Up we go. Hello? Ah! Haunted catacombs. Okay. Oh, it's not a black lit door. this thing oh it's fake okay 
Ah. Oh, then I'd go back. Okay. Okay. What did I get in here? Open. Gold bars. Okay. Hello? Oh. That ghost is clearly a mad scientist. They're all mad here. Okay, but we know that there are ghosts inside these suits of armors. And it looks like the sneakers actually do have an attack. Let's get this sneaker out of here. Okay. Well, let's power up the static shock. Hello, Boo. Arf, arf, grr, grr. Better run from Bulldog. Uh, how about we just bounce Bulldog around? Okay. Fire! Okay, and now let's put Bulldog into the vacuum. I do it. Okay. And we have our first gemstone up there. There we go, it's a diamond this time. The most important gemstone of them all. Okay, now we're at full health. Let's keep going. More haunted catacombs. Okay. Well, is there any other? Okay, there's the next one. There seems to be a knight pointing in the direction that we want to go in. Uh, 
Okay. So back. Back. There is the triangle. It's definitely a door. At one of these. This one. Where do you lead? <gasps> Hello. I'll take that gemstone. Any other secrets? Well, if you weren't at the Poltergust upgrade by now, you definitely will be. Okay. So now let's go find the Polter Pup. This way. The dungeon cell. There's Polter Pup. Oh. It's like a... Okay. So that's the haunted catacombs. Dungeon cells. Okay, so everything in the ha haunted catacombs falls under the same sort of room. Navigation. Okay. Ow. No. How dare you. I will end you, hider. Okay. So why is it important to have water around the corner? Clearly for this sprout. Oh, there's more than one sprout. Or not. Dark light. Now, before we go beyond, pull. Must just be another spot Poltapop could have been hiding in. Okay. Just wanted to confirm. Let's get the key! And with that, guys, we finished the mission. Bravo, Luigi! 
someone needs to put a leash on that blasted pooch. Eh, you're pretty far from the mansion's entrance now. It'll be faster for me to bring you back here and then send you to the entrance. Hold on. And with that, guys, we have completed E1 of the Treacherous Mansion, the front door key, which this is another good use of the polter pup. We had the key given to us at the very beginning, but we didn't get to utilize it. And we explored an area of the mansion we won't ever be looking at again until the bonus levels. Clear time, 17 uh, minutes, 11 ghosts were captured, 85 health was lost, but a lot of treasure was collected. So let us get going. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked what you saw, please leave a comment in the comment section below. Mash the like button and subscribe if you have not for more Luigi's Mansion 2 content. We will see you all next time. Derez plays out.